Hi, let's do a quick review of route summarization, also known as route aggregation. Now the reason why we summarize routes is so that there's less routes in the routing table. So let's say I've got these three IP addresses here that I want to summarize. In order to do the summarization, we have to rewrite the IP addresses out in binary. However, the only aspects we really need to look at is this last octet in this example because those are the only numbers that are different. So I'm going to take the first three octets and leave them as is, and then I'm just going to convert the last one. So to convert four into binary, we get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oops, sorry. Six, seven, eight. That's four. So then five in binary. There's five. And there's six. So we're going to analyze this last octet. Now the only thing we care about is where these IP addresses become different. So all the way up to here, they're identical to one another. So let's draw a line where they become different. Notice the first three octets are identical. Now in the last octet, they're all prefixed with a bunch of zeros and a one, and then at this point is where they change. So we just need to rewrite our IP address, taking everything from the line to the left and keeping it exactly the same. And everything from this line to the right, they're gonna become zeros. So we end up with 10.0.0, and I'm gonna keep this in binary for now. So that's this, right? It stays the same. And then everything to the right of the line just becomes zeros. So we, when we convert that into decimal, this becomes four. So our IP address of our summary route is 10.0.0.4. Now we also need to determine the subnet mass. So everywhere in the IP address where the bits are the same, we want to be ones in the subnet mask. Where they become different, we're gonna make those zeros. So our subnet mask would become, if the first octet is all ones, we get 255, the next octet is all ones, the next octet is all ones, and then the last octet is what changes. So we get all ones here, and then a zero and a zero. So we end up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which translates to 252. So our subnet mask is 255, 255, 255, 252 with our IP address of 10.004 to summarize these three routes.